great and the good of the Merseyside boxing scene were in attendance at Jamie Carragher's Cafe Sports England as the countdown began to the Tony Dodson Tony Cuddy matchup at the Liverpool Echo Arena. A rip roaring local bill, which will also see Olympic medalist David Price's professional debut, and another local matchup between Joe McNally and Graham Delahedy. What Tony had done as an amateur, I know how good he was, and I know how, how good he, he can be on his day. So I've got nothing but, you know, admiration for him in a, in a way because I know he's a talented kid and he's got to provide me with, you know, a staying test. But um, that's about it, to be honest. You know, McGee pulling out was a disappointment for me because, you know, it, me and him have been scared around maybe having played for the past five years or something. But, you know, I didn't take too much time to dwell over that. You know, it was just one of those things. Things happen for a reason. You know, this is going to be like the biggest fight since Nadi Oligan. Hopefully, we can better it. Give you something to remember. Not but respect for Tony Dodson. Uh, you know, I wasn't even on the show to start off with. Then I got offered to, to fight on it. Then I got offered an English title, and I'm fighting for the British title. And it'll be my 14th fight against someone who's is it your 30th? 29. 29. So 30th, yeah, 30th, yeah. It is your 30th, yeah. So you know. I'm, I'm, I'm just looking forward, I just want to enjoy the uh, the challenge of trying to beat Tony on the night. You know, I think I've got the skills to beat Tony. Um, and I think it's going to be a good fight for Liverpool and for the fans. But you know, I, I want to make sure I become British champion in my 14th fight in front of my home crowd. Yeah. Yeah, you're going to be fighting Tony Dodson on Get knocked out. <laughs> <laughs> I am gonna get knocked out. I can't punch. You know, I've got no boxing ability. I'm not gonna play football. You know what I mean? But, um, no, so I'm just looking forward to the fight. I've got no, nothing really to say, but um, Danny and Georgie Vaughan put me through well in the gym. Up six o'clock, running in the morning every day. I'm in the shape of your life. I've got no excuses. I'm coming to win. I'm gonna walk away with the win. Neither it's stop him or win on points, I won't lose him now. You know, and that's it really. Just come, I'm on my game. I'm just can't wait till next Saturday. Big fella. Yeah, yeah, well, obviously everyone seems to be in this, the same thing. I'm just praying my mind myself, my training's gone perfectly. Uh, in the last stage, I was supposed to go to Cyprus, but it was going that well at home that I, didn't, I decided against it. Um, about quality sparring, really enjoying the new uh, routine. It, it seems to shoot me down to the ground, and that, that's shown that I think I needed that little change to bring the best out of me. And um, you know, obviously, they've named me a opponent, which is another bonus six round fight against a man with a lot of experience. He's been in with a lot of young prospects, um, but made no bones about it on the night. I don't think Dave Inglewood will have seen anything like what's going to be in front of him on the night. Definitely. It's a big hurdle for us to live up to. Like it is, it is a big hurdle for us. Like I'm sure the pair of us will um, give it our best, and you know, one of us is going to get carried out of there, mate, and they're going to be me. I'll help you.